The following program is video supplemental instruction. VSI is brought to you by the Teaching Center, UF's Learning Support Center, www.teachingcenter.ufl.edu. The first of Piaget's stages of cognitive development is the sensory motor stage. In the sensory motor stage, the infant uses their senses and their basic motor skills. Sensory motor. This stage lasts from about birth to about two years of age and does not involve any kind of mental processes. So if you play peekaboo with an infant, they are surprised when you reveal that your face is still there because they don't have any sense of object permanence, meaning that they don't realize that your face is still there in spite of being covered with your hands. So once they develop these basic mental processes, uh, they move into the pre-operational stage, the second stage. Piaget's second stage of cognitive development is called the pre-operational stage. This stage occurs from about two years of age to about seven years of age, and it's divided up into two parts. From two to four years old, the child starts to use words as symbols to represent objects or people. So mom stands for the child's mother. Um, also during the first part of uh, the two to four years old part of the pre-operational stage, the child can play pretend, can pretend to be a doctor or a fireman or the president or you know anything like that. During the second half of the pre-operational stage from about ages four to seven, the child starts to understand the world about them, how things work. So for example, a ch the child from four to seven years old might be able to understand that I'm writing on the board to help people learn. But there's also errors in imagination and reality. They can't really distinguish the two. So they might, for example, think that the black pen likes to write on the board. Um, an interesting and creative um, observation, but not really accurate. Piaget's third stage of cognitive development is called the concrete operational stage. This begins at about six or seven years of age. The chart in your book says seven to 11 years old. So let's just go with that. What happens in this stage is that the child learns basic logical principles. They learn how to count, add and subtract numbers, and learn how to organize objects into categories or series. So for example, they could organize um, like all the blocks into a pile or all the toy animals together or something like that. The series is like organizing objects from smallest to largest. They can only do this for concrete objects though. Eraser, a marker. They can't reason about abstract principles like freedom or justice. That comes in the next stage, the formal operational stage. Piaget's fourth stage of cognitive development is called the formal operational stage. This stage occurs from about 11 years of age all the way on through adulthood. In this stage, the individual learns to think hypothetically, think about complex topics like love, politics, and religion. They can think about the future, for example, how politics today will influence the world in the future. They can um, think about scientific experiments, set up experiments, um, think about probabilities and possibilities. Basically, this is more complex thought, more abstract. The Teaching Center, UF's Learning Support Center, www.teachingcenter.ufl.edu.